her with, really? Entertainment news. Miley Cyrus has lent her fame to aid Planned Parenthood. Really? She has always wanted to take on causes, and this seems to be her newest one. First, she shared a photo of herself on Instagram wearing a button that says, Don't fuck with us. Don't fuck without us. Then she put up a picture of a t-shirt that said, Mark Jacobs, Miley Cyrus, Marilyn Minter proudly support Planned Parenthood. And then there was a limited edition print of her saying all proceeds of it would go to Planned Parenthood. Minter took the photos and designed the buttons. You can say what you want about her, but you have to give her a lot of credit for also doing a lot of good. Cheryl Burke says Dancing with Ian Zirey on Dancing with the Stars made her want to slit her wrist. Really? She says he was her least favorite partner while on the show. One of her irritants is that his name is Ian and not Ian. Sorry, my mistake. She says she begged to the executives of the show to eliminate them, but they said they couldn't. So add that to the debate of whether or not reality shows are scripted and the result fabricated. Cindy Lauper and Louis C.K. have joined the artist protest against a North Carolina law targeting the transgender community. Really? It's just growing and growing. It started with Bruce Springsteen and then Ringo Starr and Cirque du Soleil following, followed him with all pulling out of their performances. Mumford & Sons still performed but gave the proceeds to a local LGBT charity. Cindy is donating all her proceeds for an upcoming show to Equality North Carolina and Louis C.K. is saying he will do the same. So they figured out how to handle it for now, but will this stop artists from booking shows in the future? Prince's private plane had to make an emergency landing to rush him to a hospital. Really? After a concert in Atlanta, his private plane had to make an unscheduled landing in Rock Island County, Illinois. This was early Friday morning when he started experiencing flu symptoms. He was taken by ambulance to a hospital where he spent three hours before being released. He had canceled two concerts in Atlanta earlier in the month because he was ill. He showed up at a dance party near his home in Minnesota that night, telling people to wait a few days before wasting their prayers. Hopefully, he'll be partying like it's 1999 real soon.